Good morning, everybody, and welcome to another episode of LJ Law Family Law TV. My name is Bonnie Leonardo, and I am your host. Today's question is, can alimony be modified after a divorce has become final? Once again, uh, as I state always in my videos, if you have a question about this topic or any other family law topic, please go to VegasDivorceMeeting.com where you can set up an appointment with me personally and we can discuss your particular situation more at length. So to the topic at hand, can you modify alimony payments after the divorce has been finalized? The answer is yes. You can always bring a motion before the court to modify alimony payments after the divorce has been finalized unless your divorce decree specifically prohibits modification of alimony. You have to demonstrate to the court that a change has occurred in either your need for more alimony amounts monthly or for the ability to pay the alimony that was originally ordered by the court. If you're requesting a change to lower the amount of alimony, you must show the court that your gross monthly income has been reduced by at least 20%. Remember that gross monthly income is income prior to any deductions taken from your check. And in the alternative, if you are requesting a larger amount of alimony uh, per month, you must show that your financial circumstances has change in that they have drastically um, been reduced due to a medical emergency, a possible disability, or uh, maybe you have a, um, a justified increase in your monthly uh, bills. You must be aware, however, that once the ordered alimony has been met, modifications of alimony may not be possible unless the parties originally agreed to this in the divorce decree, or for some reason there was a possible mistake in the original order. Um, so it is possible to modify barring any agreements prohibiting modification, but you must meet the criteria that the courts look at, uh, such as your need and the ability to pay. I hope that this has answered uh, this question, helped to clarify it. If you have further questions about this or any other topic in family law, VegasDivorceMeeting.com is where you can meet me personally and we can uh, sit together to discuss your individual situation. And as always, I want to thank you for watching and I will see you next time.